Oh, nice peel shallots, fresh chives. All right. Let me share with you a few tips and secrets on how to make the perfect scrambled egg every single time, guaranteed. We're starting off with some room temperature eggs. The reason they're room temperature, it's because that's the way they work best and cook to become nice and tender. Whisk them up, incorporate a little air, keeping them nice and light, using a whisk or a fork. I like to add a little seasoning, salt, and freshly ground pepper. Wonderful, the salt helps release the eggs and lets them work nicely, and the, the pepper helps seasoning. Okay, over here my pan is on a medium-high heat. I'm going to add a good amount of butter. In it goes. Now, I like to add lots of butter because that adds great flavor, creaminess, and keeps it soft and tender. Butter starting to bubble. My eggs are whipped. Air is incorporated into the pan. There we go. Now, my tool of choice is a wooden spatula with a nice flat edge. Just gently work those eggs. You have to have a little patience. Stirring, working, jiggling, adjusting the heat if you need to. The key here is to keep the eggs tender, to keep them soft and even, without taking on any color, that's important. Doesn't take long, I would say three, three and a half, maybe four minutes at the most. In fact, these are probably a minute away. Well, look at this. I can see the creaminess of the eggs coming together nicely. They're still light and fluffy. A little jiggle. Look at this. Remove it from the heat. Fresh cream, 35%. In it goes, a little drizzle. This stops the cooking instantly. Fold this in. Creaminess, soft and tender. Look at that. Perfect scrambled eggs. I'm going to divide these into two. Clean pan here. Let me just lift some of that out. See how gentle they are? Wonderful. Now, what could be nicer with scrambled eggs than a little smoked salmon? Let me just drop a few pieces of smoked salmon in there. Just gently fold that around onto buttered toast. Let me just lift this out. Gorgeous. Oh. There we go. And a little bit more. Now on this one, I'm gonna add some beautiful fresh herbs. Fresh basil, chives, chervil. Give that a gentle mix. Just fold those in. The flavors of the herbs start to release once they hit the warm eggs over the toast. The perfect way to start the day. Light, fluffy scrambled eggs. And a touch of caviar. Let's add that on. Oh, look at that. Well, I think making a scrambled egg is, is not as easy as it might first seem. I think it's quite a, a difficult dish to, to perfect and, and turn out scrambled eggs in a, in a beautiful, tender manner time and time again. When I was in the hotels, we would have to make scrambled egg for 25, 30 portions at a time. And it was by doing that that I learned how to master it, I guess. Um, and that has sort of stuck with me today. And I, I take great pride in, in making a perfect scrambled egg.